So here in example two, we want to compute the standard deviation here um, for the two treatment groups and the control group. So this is the uh, honey as a cough suppressant here. So these are the improvement scores here for the honey group, uh, for the DM group, and for the control group. And then these are the dot plots. So I want you to compute standard deviation for each one of those. So enter those into a list in your calculator and compute these three standard deviations. So why don't you pause the video for a second and do that. Okay, so you should have gotten 3.39, 2.5, and 2.90. And what's important about that is this is the largest standard deviation. So this is the largest standard deviation, which is telling us that we've got the most variation in the data. So the most variability around the mean. So, and we can see that these are a little bit more spread out uh, than the others. Uh, although these are not really very far off. So we're seeing that uh, this middle one, this one looks like it has the least amount of variation overall. So this is the, although it's pretty close with the last one. So smallest standard deviation, least variation. So higher values, more variation, smaller values, less variation.